Weather forecast keeps changing. It's supposed to rain for the next three days now. Thunder showers again tomorrow. But we're gonna go try to pick today. It seems nice right now. Heading out with everybody today. Gonna try to scout some new ground and carry on in our main patch. Should be good. We've come way down these back roads today. We're quite a bit higher in elevation. There's burn up here in some spots, but we're just trying to find areas where everything's still nice, good quality. All the lower areas are uh, blowing out now and the mushrooms are too old. Sometimes up in these higher areas or where there's lots of needles, they'll still be fresh. That's what we're hunting. Okay, mixed quality, but there's some good ones here. Nice. After scouting this far side of the pond, walking down the hill across the pond, there's lots of naturals, but they're still mostly too old, or they have ash splash, which is where it rains really hard and the, the burn and the ash and the charcoal splashes up onto the mushroom and they're basically no good. But we are seeing more fire morels every day, so that's a good thing. We'll just keep checking different spots today and get what we can. Okay, we've come way down the roads now, heading up more into the mountainous area. Most of our patch has been at 1,200 meters, and we see that all the volume in that, at that elevation is sort of going bad. So now we're at 1,400 meters, which is about as high as we can get on this road. And we're just gonna go check with our buckets, and then if it's good, we'll drive across this old rickety bridge. sound of a sandhill crane. Prehistoric looking birds. Well, the mushrooms are a little fresher up here. Better than down the hill. And now it's pouring rain again. There wasn't enough volume in there anyways, so we'll go back to the truck and get dry. day all last night I ran out of space on the uh, memory card for the camera went to transfer to the hard drive and the $3,000 laptop was dead motherboard gave out but it's on warranty but so what I had to do is go to town and uh, 
get a bunch of uh, memory cards, SD cards, so I can keep filming. So, camera's running again. We've just been picking enough the last couple days to fill the dryer each day and keep that rolling, turning over. We've got our 50 pounds of dried, all boxed up and ready for sale. They're really nice quality. Some of them aren't as nice of quality, so we've kind of graded these down a bit. There's nothing wrong with them, but I don't know if I'd sell them for top dollar. They're just not as nice. They're larger. Yeah, they're fine. That was a big mushroom. There's five smaller pork tenderloins in there. Oh, that's hot. Woo! That's a heavy pot. <laughs> Cobbler getting started in the top. Nicely done. What are you? Some kind of traveling circus? Yeah. Here we have the most valuable member of our crew. Oh, what are you doing there, dog? <laughs> okay, go find the mushrooms. Go get the mushrooms. Yeah, like a, a basket harness for her. <laughs> get a little, couple little mini baskets on either side. Haul yeah. some weight. You gonna do your part, dog? Oh yeah. Oh, oh my lunch. Stoked. Freaking eat. That pork looks awesome. Are you stoked? <laughs> you don't get any now. No, just kidding. No cobbler for you. Gonna check on the cobbler. See how it's looking. Uh-oh, one new piece is coming. Look at that. Full of peaches. That yeah. Cobbler cake. Nice. Beauty. Oh yeah, that's done. That is done. Oh, that's wonderful. Oh, look at that. Go behind you. Wheeling and dealing. Wheeling and dealing. Who's got the three of clubs? 